So in honor of Flight of the Concords returning to TV, I wanted to talk about how to play The Humans Are Dead on piano. I'm more or less going off of the version that you uh, that is on the uh, CD or the recorded album. Um, there's some different versions. On, uh, the version on the TV show is a little different as well. But um, this is just kind of listening to the guitar parts and the playing through. And I'll give you the sections. And if you can go home and play it on your own piano and make it your own, that's my goal. So it starts, it has that little slide on the guitar. I'm glissandoing off of E. I'm just kind of hitting those A's. And it really just goes between A, you can make it A minor, I think I did, and C major if you want, or A minor, or A, no third, C, no third. And there's that long introduction on A, going to A and C back and forth where the robots are talking. Um, I'm improvising over A minor, um, putting some wrong notes in there as well. And then when it gets to the chorus, the humans are dead on A minor, D minor. C, back to D minor, if you want to make a D minor 7, the C natural in there, A minor, D minor, C, that's the chorus more or less, uh, the verses part or the second chorus part, um, the system of oppression is on F to G, and global robo depression on D minor, to C, back to F, to G, F, and this time we end on the E7. chorus or whatever whatever part you want to play next there's that little interlude uh where the robot and the robot captain are asking each other like can't we just talk to the humans and that's on d minor seven there's a g7 i'm adding the sixth and the ninth in there c major seven f major seven there's a b flat major seven in there and then it resolve or it doesn't resolve yet, but goes to the E7, so it can resolve back to A minor. So I'll play that. It's a very, very jazzy, very um, uh, it's a very well used jazz progression. No, we can't talk to them because because they are dead. Um, let's see. There's the boogie part, robo boogie part, um, where I'm just doing octaves on A to D. Robo boogie, uh, boogie, just a, a C to A. Anything I missed? I think that's all of it. You can end it however you want. It's nice because you can play in A minor and do kind of some bluesy licks, or you can deliberately play the wrong notes and make it really clashing. It's always a challenge to try to match something that has been done by a band, and especially with robot voices, onto the piano. Um, you know, there's that binary solo, which kind of follows the, the hits on the chords. I didn't play it in my version, but it follows the hits on the chords for the, um, for the, ver for the chorus, excuse me, to D minor. 
to C to D, and they're doing zero 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 one one one. You know that robot solo there. Um, you could have fun with that as well. Um, I think that's all the parts. If I left something out or missed something, let me know in the comments, and I'll try to pin your comment. Um, but I hope that helps, and I hope you enjoy the new season of uh, Flight of the Concords. And maybe you can play some of their tunes on the piano at home. All right, thank you for watching.